guys today the sun is doing the most oh my god like this thing is not straight yeah oh hi guys <laughs> welcome back to my youtube channel if it's your first time here karibu 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 sana but guys can we just take a moment to appreciate the sun hey i'm it's me who's just looking peng peng things fine girl no pimple <laughs> Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it's your first time here, karibu, 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 sana! I'm so excited that you're here, that you could join me, that we could have, you know, a few minutes together. My name is Floki, for those who are new here. And yeah, after this video, you know, consider subscribing and, and liking the video, sharing it with your friends. If you feel that it's content that, you know, speaks to you. For my returning subscribers, thank you, thank you guys. Thank you for the support, man. I see y'all. I see y'all. I heart y'all. I heart y'all. Now we're panda. Guys, eh? so today it's gonna be a very short video about. It's, I just want to encourage someone who's in a season of waiting. Guys, waiting can be hard. Waiting is like a. Hey, waiting is hard though. <laughs> Have you, like if you're impatient like me, even waiting on a queue at the bank is. I'm just always like tapping my feet. I'm like, oh my God, I should have just used mobile banking. What the, what the, like, <laughs> you know? Um, but I want to talk to someone who is going through that season and it feels tough. It feels like God is just, you know, playing hide and seek on your matter. Oh yeah, you're asking and he's just, <laughs> I, I want to encourage you that, you know, God's timing is always perfect and i know we say that a lot we say it it's almost it almost sounds cliche oh god's timing is perfect don't worry god, but it's not easy when you're in the wait when you're in the thicket when you're in the thick of things it's hard to wait and i want to encourage someone who's in that season of waiting because i have been in a season of waiting for a couple of times you know there are seasons in my life when i've had to wait there are things in my life that I've had to really wait for, you know, something that you thought was just straightforward, instant, yeah, instantaneous kind of thing takes forever and a day because God wants to teach you in this season of waiting. So I want to encourage you and I want to give you three things that you can take from your season of waiting. The first thing is that it's a season to grow your faith in God. It's a season to dig deep you know, and to be reminded of his faithfulness, you know, or to be reminded of who he is. Because there's a quote that I love. I don't know who said it, but it's, <clears throat> if you understand his nature, you will never question his motives. So you need, as Christians, we need to get to that level, that point of, I know my God. I know he has my best interest at heart. And I'm not worried. You know, I'm going through this season. Um, he's making me wait or he's making like it's just lagging or it's a tough season. Um, but I trust in his faithfulness. I trust in his persona. I trust in the person that he is and that he has shown himself to be. So it's a season of growing your faith in God. You know, it's also a season of nurturing your character and that speaks to patience you know it speaks to um your, your your character in loving god despite the things that he gives or does not give he gives or fails to give um of of loving god for who he is you know and not necessarily what he does for you you know it's a season of building your patience which is part of your character and sometimes you know you find yourself having to wait for promises that god promised you you know and he assured you that i'm gonna do this for you and you're here you're looking around you and you're like god when when I, like when you know I, and i think about abraham in the bible where he was told about he was given promises that had to do with his descendants, his children's children. I will bless you. I will bless your children's children. Oh yeah, you will be a father of nations. And 
Papa Abe is 60, no child. 70, no children. 80, eh, 90, you know? So I think it's it's just developing. It's just uh, a, 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 a character trait that God usually wants to build in us, yeah? As his children. And the third thing is to not miss the lesson in the waiting <clears throat> i have learned i have come to learn that in every season that god takes us through in every season of waiting there's a lesson and my prayer nowadays even as i go through tough times even as i go through seasons of just you know uncertainty of not knowing what next is god what's the lesson for me in this and i want i want that when i come out of this uh to not have missed the lesson that you had for me in this season, yeah? So just be be very sensitive, be very keen to listen to what God has to say uh, in terms of what the lesson of the season is. Because when, it, when you come out of it, you need to come out of it better, you need to come out of it bigger, you need to come out of it in such a manner that you can speak to the next person who's going through it. Um, in a way that is encouraging to them. So yeah, that's just my <clears throat> short nugget of the day. I just want to share that word with you and to just also, you know, remind us that waiting is, it's part of life, you know, it's part of life. And sometimes it's hard, I know. Sometimes it can be very hard. It can be very tiring, tiring, yeah? Especially when God makes you wait for certain things manze you're just like god i know you can do this in like but you're making me wait you know so for me in such situations i've learned to ask myself why is he making me wait and what does he expect me as his child to learn in this season yeah so um like i was, I was making a joke the other day and i'm like god me i'm ready i am ready I am ready to be a millionaire. I'm ready to be a kingdom millionaire. Oh yeah, bless me, bless me, be my blesser, <laughs> you know? But he knows, he knows what is best for me and that maybe it's not the right time for me to have whatever it is that I'm asking for. So whatever lesson is there, you know, in that season, make sure you take it, you know, make sure you grasp it, make sure it doesn't pass you because maybe you're too angry or you're too focused on other things. Make sure you get the lesson in the season. Yeah. So yeah, I, that's just my short video of the day. And uh, I hope someone somewhere is encouraged, you know, be encouraged if you're somewhere, you're waiting, waiting on God for his promises, uh, waiting on God for something, for a child, for a miracle, for, you know, a visa for a, uh, a job you know just trust that his timing is perfect and that in every season he he's got your best interest at heart he's got your best interest at heart all right so yeah that marks the end of my video today yeah and uh, I hope you're encouraged you know feel free to share the video and I will see you on my next uploaded video bye bye